Hey guys, so I got a recording app on my phone, so I'm going to try a voiceover and see how it goes. I'm going to do my St. Patrick nails today. Let's start off with Revlon Posh, my favorite green. It's like a dark green, and I feel like there's so many light greens out there, so I was really happy when I found this. So I'm going to be painting my thumb and my pinky nail with this. It's probably going to take about two coats because it's not too translucent, but enough to wear two coats at least on the thumb could do. This is so crazy. I've never done a voiceover, so it's probably going to be like really bad. <laughs> I'll just have to get used to it. Next, I'm doing my Milani Gold. It's like my favorite nail polish ever. It just looks like liquid gold in a bottle. And I'm going to be putting that on my middle finger as like a base for it. Really, really pretty. Super shimmery. Okay, so my pointer finger and my ring finger, I'm going to be taking pastel colors to make a rainbow. And that's going to be like my base for those two. I'm just going to sponge them on. I don't use liquid latex, especially when it's pastel. I mean, it's really easy to clean up with some acetone and a Q-tip. <laughs> it took me so long, so I only filmed the pointer finger, basically. But it turned out really pretty. This is my new fast drying coat from Ice. Honestly, I mean, I feel like my gel coat from Revlon that I use dries a lot quicker than this does and it looks a lot prettier, but I was willing to give it a try. It looks so pretty, like a unicorn skin. I definitely like that look. That is so satisfying to just cut the little parts that you used on a nail sponge off. <laughs> Okay, so this is my Oh Really. It's hollow gold, but I mean, it's, I don't know. It's not hollow -y enough for me. It does have some rainbow stuff in there, but when I just use it, it doesn't come out as hollow as I would like it, but it's still really pretty. And I'm just going to put that on top of my middle finger to kind of give it some more sparkly goodness. <laughs> I'm going to do the sponge trick because especially with this one, there's a lot more of the jelly than the glitter, so it's better to just sponge it on. Sparkly! So I'm dipping my posh out two drops so I can do my nail art for my pastel fingers. And I'm just going to take a bobby pin. And I'm going to do three dots starting from the bottom to the top to make little shamrocks. And I'm only going to do three of them. So there's going to be like two big ones and one small one on the top. And I did it on the left side of my nail on both of them. So in here, that's where all my jelly roll pens are and all my other like Sharpies and stuff that I use for my nail art. And I'm taking my green and my gold. So the green, I basically just went in to do stems to make it more like shamrocky. And then the gold, I actually did big polka dots on my thumb and ring finger. I forgot when you use a brand new jelly roll pen, like it's kind of more liquidy than you would like, but it worked out okay. Once it dried, it wasn't so liquidy looking. The middle I'm just taking a sharpie and doing like a black belt type thing and I didn't like the art that came out like the shamrock so I redid it and made it look like a belt and that's it so 
Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to do my Naruto series next, so please subscribe, and I will see you all in my next video.